Okay guys, so with a brand new Spider-Man Homecoming trailer confirmed for tomorrow, we actually have a clip that gives us an insight into something that I don't think many of us thought was going to be in the movie. Now this is just a quick clip, um, and there's a couple of them in there, but I'm only going to talk about one specific moment. So ever since the reveal of the new suit, there's been a lot of debate regarding the new spider symbol. Uh, a lot of people like it, a lot of people hate it, um, there's people that are in the middle with it. I happen to be one of the people that's kind of just in the middle with it. I don't really have a preference to it either way. Um, I think it's a little too small. Now, when we actually get to the logo, this new clip actually goes into why it's like that and why it has this 3D depth and everything. So, in this new clip, we actually see Spider-Man, and this is a scene where he's in Washington, and we see that that spider is actually a physical thing so what you're seeing right now is a picture of it so the spider actually physically lifts off of his chest and you know we actually see it come off and in the next frame we actually see it fly off of him and kind of fly into the distance now obviously this is very interesting considering it's brand new tech for spider-man that we haven't seen in any of the movies really um Essentially, I'm expecting that this is going to be the MCU Spider-Man version of the Spider Tracer. Now, for those of you that don't know what that is, essentially, uh, Spider Tracer is his own personal GPS. He has this little device, he can stick it onto stuff, and then he can trace it through his GPS. Um, uh, I kind of speculated that they would use this at some point, specifically when I was talking about the little details that we see at the end of Civil War in the credit clip, uh, you know, where I pops up and we see all that i was like they'd have to use the spider tracer at some point because this seems like it's going to be the most techie version of peter parker and it would make sense if he uses it to track down maybe vulture or someone else or maybe there's a giant attack that happens in washington which is why he's in his suit and that probably involves the vulture so he sets that on him and he traces you know where he's going so honestly it's a pretty cool little addition that uh i really never thought we would see in a movie but i really can't wait to see how they're going to utilize it because it's such a cool concept and it gives peter that edge and kind of makes him do some little you know like detective work to figure out if it goes out or anything if it stops working uh i really like it so hopefully we see more of it um obviously the new trailer is due out tomorrow so we'll be covering that here on cbc so you guys let me know your thoughts on the spider tracer making its appearance in the movie and how excited you are for the trailer